How to Catch a Monster by Adam Wallace and Andy Elkerton. School is done. I'm heading home. It was such an awesome day. I got the role of Ninja Master in this year's school play. So now I'm feeling brave and strong and full of courage too. But if I'm going to be a hero, there's one thing left to do. See, there's a monster in my closet with claws and teeth and hair. And tonight, I'm going to scare him. He just lives, he lives just right through there. I spot my monster right away. He's practicing his roar. He almost scares me half to death, but I won't be scared anymore. I reach into my bag of tricks and pull out my first trap. I'll catch my monster right away. It'll be a snap. Okay, he's stronger than I thought. I'm not finished yet. I'll catch him in my super sticky ninja nabbing net. Ack, he just escaped again. My next trap will not miss. I'll give him every trick I've got. He won't get out of this. I stare at him, and he stares back. His monster eyes look sad. I'm sorry, friend. I really am. Oh, please, just don't be mad. I never meant to scare you. I did it by mistake. It's hard to play when you're asleep. I want you wide awake. The monster pulls the bars apart. When my ninja bot lets go, he smiles and a rips he smiles and rips a giant burp. Sorry, not polite, I know. That's how we say hello, my friend. We do it all the time. Just take a whiff. You'll see it smells like strawberries and lime. And then he takes me to his house, which seems a little weird. He lets me meet his mom and dad. Is this the creature that I feared? We play for hours and have such fun and eat volcano pie. And when he throws me in the air, he throws me really high. Then, at last, it's time for bed. He helps me brush my teeth, but he squeezes all my toothpaste out. He's strong beyond belief. The night is done, and Mom comes in to tuck me nice and tight. I'm glad I'm feeling safe and sound. It's time to say good night. Good night. The end. Happy Halloween, everybody.